best chance at, at, at really combating gun violence. So we just encourage everybody, encourage everybody to be a part of the solution. And that means bringing together the city, churches, and community members. Good evening, I'm Jessica Coons. Tonight, groups in Champaign worked together on solutions for safety. This comes after several shootings over the years at an American Legion post. Three shootings have happened since 2018 at post 559 on North Hickory Street. WCI3's Bryce Beeman joins us. Bryce, walk us through what has happened there. Earlier this month, one person was killed and four others were hurt after a shooting in the Legion's parking lot. Family was holding a funeral luncheon. In August of 2018, a 48-year-old man was shot and killed outside the entrance. And in November of that same year, a woman was shot in her car after leaving the, Le the Legion. She did survive. Now, city officials are looking for ways to bring safety to the area to make sure scenes like this don't happen again. We will not be scared away because of gun violence. We won't normalize gun violence. After a shooting earlier this month killed one person and hurt four at the American Legion Post 559, the city of Champaign teamed up with the Legion to focus on safety in the neighborhood. We won't be run off by these instances. And so as a, as a community and as a city, you know, we, we are determined to keep showing up and keep rallying and keep mobilizing people as often as they'll show up and they'll have us. So we would encourage that same sentiment in the community. They hosted a forum which included resources that spoke about ways to help kids deal with gun violence ways to deal with your own trauma from gun violence, and they also talked about mental health resources available. Other resources included ways to help people who are involved in gun violence escape that lifestyle, as well as crime stoppers who encourage people to call in tips anonymously. Really trying to push out information, resources, but at the same time let the community know that if they have information or if they would like to start, you know, being a part of the process um, of, you know, the movement to end gun violence in their community, that there are lots of avenues for them to join. And the American Legion is also increasing safety measures. They'll be using their cameras and also working with police to patrol the area consistently. But they hope this forum will help spark ways to stop the violence. I just feel for the families, okay? I just really do. I really feel for the families that they had to go through this. And we hope and pray that something come out of this meeting that can make sure that this don't happen again. If you want more information on the groups involved during the forum, we will have that information on our website. Jess? All right, Bryce, thank you.